Okay, tell us who you are. Uh, my name is Katie Dorge, and I am a part-timer here at Salmon Creek. All right, tell us a little bit about your Sherwin story, how you got started here. What are you doing here? Um, so I started a little over six months ago. Um, I previously worked at Target. Do not recommend. It was awful. I um, worked there for like three months and barely survived. And then took a little break and came back or I came here, found two recruits, family members and family friends. They really like it, like the community and all the coworkers. And so I joined and I'm loving it so far. Wonderful. All right, this one is always a good one. Tell me about the first spill that you made. Um, so it was like, I was like a month in and this customer wanted a can or a gallon of Super Deck solid. And so we had one gallon left of like what he, exactly what he wanted. And so I went, put it in the shaker. He ordered a few other gallons, put them in this box and the bottom of the box was ripped. So I was like, maybe, maybe not do that. Well, I did it anyways, took the box, put the gallons in it. And I went to hand him the box and my hand was not on the bottom and his wasn't either. And that one gallon left of super deck fell out of the bottom of the box on the ground went everywhere that me and my coworker had to like close the store so people would stop walking through it and it was a mess it was not sorry i felt really bad for this man so okay how do you want to be remembered at sherwin or any workplace for that matter um i mean a lot of people i'm really loud i am a loud person um i can be funny outgoing a good leader um uh, you know, I'm fun to be around. If everyone's in a good mood, I'm in a great mood. Like, it's just, I I'm, I don't know. I, I pick on people, but don't be mad if I pick on you and you pick on me. Like, we're, you know, uh, but yeah, that's, I guess. Okay. Okay, since starting with Sherwin six months ago, uh, what has made you want to stay with us? Um, Probably the amazing coworkers and everyone's really supportive really helpful. I will say like, there is a lot to learn, a lot to figure out and having supportive coworkers helping through that, it makes it so much easier. Um, and yeah, I'd honestly just say the workspace and the environment, it's nice. All right, what are some of your interests outside of work? Um, I kind of go by season. I'm a huge Disney fan, by the way. I love Disney, only watch Disney movies, like, ever. Um, but I also, in the summertime, I love to wakeboard. That's my favorite thing ever. Go spend the time at the lake with family, in the water. I'm a big mermaid, if you want to say. <laughs> um, and then recently, I just got into snowboarding and have been loving that. So that's kind of, in the winter, I'm snowboarding. In the summer, I'm wakeboarding. And in between, I'm watching Disney movies. So fun. All right, let's hear the funniest moment at Sherwin-Williams Salmon Creek so far. Um, probably Zach's birthday. He was gone for like four days. Took a long weekend. And I decided, why not fill this office floor with balloons? Um, so all the coworkers, we all, I bought over like 400 balloons and we literally blew up almost every single one of them and filled this floor full of balloons and covered the door window. And he came in that Monday when he first day back and I worked with him and he immediately blamed it on me and knew that I set everything up and <laughs> that I had to clean it up my whole entire shift. So I spent my shift popping all these balloons, but it was really worth it because he was actually surprised. That's awesome. And it's hard to do. All right, so we got your funniest moment. What is your most memorable moment at Sherwin Williams? Um, probably actually a couple weeks ago, I was working. It was Sunday, and I saw this thing run across the ground, and I was like, "Oh, that's interesting." Don't know what that was. Like whatever. Well, it was a mouse. It was sitting in the middle of our aisle, just sitting there. And I was like, oh, there's a mouse in here. So <laughs> Anton and I tried to catch this mouse. Well, kind of failed. So we came in Monday morning and Zach had caught the mouse. It was in front of our fridge. He threw a garbage can over it. We caught the mouse. 
but then he wanted to keep it till it died. Well, if you don't know, mice live for like a month or two without like food. If they've like had water, like they live a long time, take a long time to die. And I was like, Zach, we can't let this mouse stink up this whole office because we're all gonna puke whatever because it's gonna stink. So I decided to take cardboard and we put it under the mouse and Zach took it to the dumpster and threw some garbage can or garbage bags on it and thought it died, but hey, we got rid of the mouse. All right, who has been a mentor to you at Sherwin-Williams thus far and what have they done to impact you? Um, someone who's impacted me the most probably, um, shout out Dax. Um, he's been super helpful through like this whole six months. Um, he's always like that, like to take a second just to ask if you're okay. Like I came in one morning and it was just busy and whatnot. And he literally looked at me and was like, you don't look very happy. What's wrong? And I was like, oh, thanks for asking. Like, I'm good. Thanks. Like, but he's always, he's just willing to help what wants us to learn. And yeah, same, like another one, Chad, oh my God, he's the most patient human being you will ever meet. Um, like literally you have questions, Chad's always there. He's, he won't yell at you. He won't like get upset at you for not knowing the answer to certain things. Like those two people are like literally there for you no matter what. All right, and lastly, if you could give one message to everybody in the district, what would it be? Um, probably just be willing to learn. Um, there's a lot to know about paint, stains, you name it. Um, and just try and take in the information, but don't get stressed about it. Um, and just have fun. Like, it's, I mean, I always come in and everyone's like, Katie, what's wrong? I'm like, nothing. Like, I'm just, I'm glad I'm here making money and living my dream. <laughs> um, and just here with good coworkers that have my back. Awesome.